in the same state where the first dinosaur was unearthed and mounted for public display more than 150 years ago, there exists an operation that brings the prehistoric past back into focus. This is Phil Fraley Productions in Patterson. We're a exhibit fabrication company. Primarily we're known for working with paleontological artifacts, uh, meaning uh, dinosaurs and uh, mammals uh, from anywhere from 160 million years in age up to contemporary specimens. Fraley's work is seen by thousands of people daily at the American Museum of Natural History in New York City. He was hired on at the museum in 1990 to coordinate the $45 million Fossil Hall renovation project. Back at Fraley's studio, a team of artists, sculptors, and engineers is currently working on a large-scale exhibit for a museum in California. The centerpiece will be a T-Rex growth series. Uh, what Los Angeles County Museum of Natural His History is attempting to do here is to present the life cycle of the animal Tyrannosaurus rex. So what is it about the T-Rex that seems to draw so much attention? I think there's a little bit of uh, terror and a little bit of fear, and it's a little bit scary. Uh, you definitely know when you see the T-Rex what it's about. It, it, it does appeal to people. It has captured the imagination of the public. And I think it turns us grown-ups into kids again to come back with that, oh my god, look at that fellow. His grandson thought the dinosaurs were about three inches long and made out of plastic, because that's what he had seen and been done. And when you come in here, it's just the wow factor is just fantastic. 